Hello guys, welcome back to Lola's Kitchen and welcome back to another Ramadan recipe. I'm super happy to have you here. Welcome. And please one thing, don't forget to subscribe and hit your ring bell so you don't miss any of my videos. And today's recipe will be this yummy, delicious, I mean on point, like fire guys. This chicken pepper soup is so yummy. I got this recipe from my mom even though I already like make it very similar but some of the stuff she added i was like wait what you put that in your chicken paper soup she's like girl yes i mean she didn't say that by the way she talking our native language <laughs> anyways guys let's get started so um that's my african chicken when i'm making paper soup or frying i love using the african chicken because it's so much better the one we have here is just it's just like um too soft so anyways, uh, I already clean it and I clean my um, chicken with vinegar. And then the next thing is this um, like cilantro green pepper that I blend it all together. And then the next thing will be the red bell pepper, which mine is frozen because I usually froze them because I don't want them to go to waste. And then the next thing will be the habanero. I have the red one. It's also the African one. You can use the yellow one, but again, you know, it's very hot. And the big mama, the onion. And then, so the rest, I just gonna be, oh guys, oh, sorry, the dawa. Yes, that's one thing my mom added in there. And I was like, wait, what? You're gonna need some the dawa. So yeah, please make sure you do have the dawa because I feel like it took this chicken paper soup to a whole another level. And the rest, I just my seasonings, as you can see, I'm just showing it to you guys. And then now here we go, I already added some water and as you can see, I add a lot of water in there because, um, you know, the chicken is really hard and I like it, it's well cooked. So that's why you have to add a lot of water. And then Gashinakawins, I just added some salt, some black pepper. That's one thing I didn't show you guys, but do add some please. As you know, sometimes when you're cooking, then you're like, oh, I forgot I didn't add this, I didn't add that. So sometimes I know I do that a lot because I was like, oh, something is missing so just like that like that but definitely if i do add something i didn't show at the beginning i try my best to tell you guys just like right now for the black pepper so do add some please and then you don't have to add all the seasonings right now you just add like some of it and then the rest later on as you can see i only add salt and then some maggi and then gashina nari pitukunya and then now here we go i'm just gonna blend everything right now I just have onions and then the um yeah is it the red yeah the red bell pepper and habanero see some tomatoes that's it pretty much and even for the tomato i only add like one and then gashini yinziri i come back in at the tapasa so that's good and there's not much water now and that's how i want it to be and i think i let it on fire for literally like one hour 15 minutes so just add everything in there right now as you can see, it's not well blended, so it's just like jajagi. So that's how we want it to be. Unless if you like your pepper soup to just be very smooth, so then you can blend everything. But for me, that's how I like it. And that is some curry. Do add some curry. You know, curry make it really smell really nice. So and then now, yes, that is the dadawa. <laughs> now we're gonna add some of the dadawa. As you can see i added a lot because even my mom when she's that's like what that's a lot of the dough she was like let me get out of this kitchen i was just like mom are you sure are you sure like it's not gonna taste good and also this is the time she added some of the kanan pari but i didn't add any right now i don't have some sadly yes i used some few days ago when i was making um zobu and i don't know somehow i forgot to get any so but do add some all right now that kind of party and then you can see i just added some thyme i added the rest of the seasoning guys right here this is the good time to add all the curry everything else because now you, we're only gonna leave it like for 30 minutes by then and then make sure you mix it and go back and close it and then guys 40 minutes later look at it yes it smells good the aroma is so yummy and i hope you guys enjoy this recipe and yeah guys and also guys if you guys want this um repression cucumber lemonade i already have the recipe down below so just check it yes guys i already have everything for you guys so yes if you want everything you see on the table it's already there so do check it it's really 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 nice and it's went perfectly like together with the um, 
chicken pepper soup it was really delicious so yeah if you want everything do try and make it just scroll down and you will find the cucumber lemonade and yeah guys happy iftar even though some of us i know like somewhere like in nigeria it's already iftar time and us it's just 3 p.m right now so we have a long way to go <laughs> like maybe like five more hours to go inshallah and yeah guys ramadan mubarak once again thank you so much and again please if you're new here don't forget to subscribe and if you're already again like comment and share with your family and friends i'll see you guys in my next video thanks